Hey what's up guys, how's it up here and today I'm going to be talking about a problem where your phone might be connected to the internet but your phone says connected but no internet access. You might be seeing an exclamation mark right next to your Wi-Fi symbol and I'm going to be telling you how to get connected back to internet. So there are a few solutions to this and I'm going to be telling you every one of them. I would suggest you to watch through every solution because you never know which one might work for you. So without any further ado, let's get straight into the solutions and see how it's done. So first things first, the most naive solution is just going and checking your Wi-Fi router and checking the cables if they're connected or not. So once you've verified that your Wi-Fi router is not the problem and the cables are connected properly, we can debug the issue on your Android smartphone. So let's go on to settings. And the first solution is to actually reset your date and time. So this is the leading problem for Wi-Fi not being connected. And a lot of people actually solve this problem by just simply resetting the date and time. So all you want to do is go to settings and then search for date. And once you're here, you want to search, you want to go to date and time. And once you're on date and time, make sure that your date and time is correct. Maybe using another smartphone or using your clock. Make sure that you're using network provided time and you're using the network provided time zone. So these two settings are very important. You need to reset your time zone and reset your time to the correct time. And then uh, the internet will start working properly. So the next thing that you can try doing if the date and time solution does not work for you is just to simply go onto your Wi-Fi settings here and click on the uh, internet that you connected to. So what you want to do is you want to forget this network. You click on that and then you'll get this option to forget the network. So you click on that and you forget the network. And once you've forgotten the network, you wait for it to show up on the list again. Like I can see it's right here. And when, once it's here, type in your password and then connect to the Wi-Fi again. I'm going to type in my password. So once I've typed in my password, I'm going to connect again. And uh, it's going to say connecting and then obtaining IP address and all that. And hopefully this helps you solve your problem and then your internet is back on again. So even if this does not solve your problem, then you still cannot connect to your Wi-Fi. Um, go ahead and then forget this network again. Once again, click the forget network and wait for it to show up on the list again here. So once you're here, type in your password again. So once your password is down, what you want to do is just click these advanced options right here and then go on and then change your IP settings to static. You have to see all these settings. So I'm setting the IP setting static and then the IP address. You can you have to set that to the same number here, but then change the last three digits. So this last three digits can go from uh, one to 255. It can be anything. So I'm going to type in the same thing. So it can be, it can be anything from zero to 255. So you do that and then the DNS one should be 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 and the DNS two should be 8.8.4.4 .8 like it says here. So once this is done, once you have put these settings, you've changed the DNS two to this, DNS one to that, and then the IP address to anything. Once you've done that, you can go ahead and click connect. And this should hopefully bring back your internet and then you should be able to connect to your internet again. So as you can see, I'm connected again and there's no issues. So yeah guys, that was it for today and I hope it worked out for you. And if it did, please do consider sharing this with your friends and family to let them know how to get connected back to the internet. And once again, that's all for today. Thanks a lot and I'll see you in the next one.